Hi everyone and welcome to Evie's Toy House and take a look. Today we got our first Miniverse Make It Mini appliances. These are super cute. I've been seeing them all over Instagram and they are just the most amazing thing ever. So I ordered four of these online. Since it was ordered online, I was not able to choose the ones that I wanted. So I got one of these um, milk tea machines. I got a soda machine and we got two espresso machines. It does say here, each of these appliances come in two different styles. So I think they come in two different colors. So we have a pink one and a green one. And over here in the back, it does say that this series has eight to collect. So I think the only one that we don't have today is the slushy machine. But between these two espresso machines, hopefully we get one of each color. So let's go ahead and get started. Oh, these surprise balls are actually really big. Oh, we got the pink one. So we got two cups and saucers. Here is our espresso machine in pink. Isn't it beautiful? Look at this. I love the shade of pink. Here is a placemat. All right, so we got a bottle of coffee and some whipped cream. And here's our checklist. So we have these two soda fountains, one in red, one in blue. We have the espresso machine, the teal one and the pink one. We also have a bubble machine. Here is a purple one and a pink one. And we also have a juice dispenser and a yellow one. Now for the fun part, let's make some espresso. So as you can see here, once you open it up, this is where we're going to put our coffee. Okay, I'm going to put it face down, cap it back up, and put our cup in. Now we're going to turn the lever. Espresso's coming out. you see that? That is so cool. Once it's almost full, let's go ahead and close this. Here's our espresso. Now I'm going to cure it under the UV lamp. So our espresso is now cured. It's actually pretty hard. But now we need to add the whipped cream. So I'm going to put this in here and to add just a little bit more espresso. Just a drop. Then I'm going to add our whipped cream. And we're going to cure it again. In this way, the whipped cream doesn't fall out. Our drink is done. Let's make another one. Alright, I think that is a pretty full cup. Let's go ahead and cure it. So I cured it for about a minute and this is interesting. So it looks like the top layer has cured but not fully on the inside. So you can still see the air bubble moving on the inside. But I think that's okay. We're going to add a whipped cream anyways. Let's switch this on to see if we can get another drop out. Okay, so that's perfect for a whipped cream and cure it again. All right, so here are the two cups of espresso that we made. One has a lot more liquid in it, so it's fuller, and this other one has a little bit less. I wasn't sure the first time if there would be enough for both cups, so I was a little bit conservative on the first cup. However, it does seem like there is quite a lot to go around, so we can actually make two pretty full cups. And to make sure that you can reuse the skin, what I would do is take out the components on the inside and just wipe it clean with a wet wipe. So a baby wipe or um, a wet paper towel would work. And in here you can take a Q-tip and just wipe away the resin here. Alright, next one. Let's go ahead and make some boba. It's purple and probably taro flavored.
Here is our made fresh mat. Oh wow, this is pretty complicated. So here's the dispenser, and here is a lid sealer. Here we got the boba, the milk tea, and a bag of ice. Here we have a cup holder, two cups, and a boba straw. So this time, let's make both cups at the same time. Here is our boba. Now I'm going to add some ice. Now let's dispense. Take our milk tea here and let's put this upside down. And to dispense, we're going to have to push this lever. Oh, you can see the milk tea. And let's fill the other cup. And if it's coming out too slow, we can come back up here and give it a squeeze. And then dispense some more. Okay, now we're going to seal the cups. And let's add a straw. And there's our first cup. Alright, so here are the two cups of taro milk tea. Next, let's make a soda fountain. And here's our soda fountain. We got a red one. And it dispenses lemon lime soda. Some lemon lime soda and a bag of ice. Here's a cup holder, two cups, two lids, and two straws. Inside the machine, we got two spaces, one for ice and one for the soda. Let's pour in the ice. Let's take our first cup and dispense some ice first. Here's our ice. Now let's dispense the soda. So we need to push in this lever. Here's our soda, lime green. Let's do the other cup too. Now we have two cups of soda. Let's add the lid and insert the straws. Now we're going to care with a UV light. And our two cups of soda are done. Alright everyone, so we have one more to go. This one is a duplicate. This one is an espresso machine, but hopefully we can get the teal one. Oh no, we got the duplicate. So this one is another pink one. So here it is. And since this one is a duplicate, let's go ahead and save it for another video. Alright everyone, this was so much fun. And so now the goal is to get the second colors for each of these and also the juice machine. So if you enjoyed this video and want to see more like it, make sure to subscribe and I'll see you next time. Bye!